Welcome to another night of great hockey action with Eddie Olchek, Ray Ferraro later on. I'm Mike Emery. Home stretch of the season, the month of March, and an interesting matchup tonight dictated by the standings. Eddie, before we get this underway, what are some key things we should be thinking about as these two teams go at it? This one is all about emotion. It's about controlling emotion. So if you can dictate that, you got a pretty good shot in this game, Doc. This is going to be a good test. John Tavares, the first overall draft choice of 2009. Four years later, the Islanders made him their captain. Winner of Olympic gold in Sochi. A year later, he was a first-team All-Star. Carried towards the corner by Boychuk. Scooped up by Suster. St. Petersburg's carrying it through center. Propelled to Calvert. Backhander to the net. Handled with the stick. Snapping a pass to Everly. Oh, snaps a shot. Oh, what a save. He brought his best shot, and it got stopped. And angled to Suster. That's a great save. Puck loose, denied by the defense. Let's it go. He hit the post on the outside with a shot. Saved with the pad. And decides to just hold on and get a stoppage of play. Down near the players is Ray Ferraro. All the window dressing around this team looks great. The arena's beautiful. The jerseys look fantastic. The merchandise is all over the stands as the fans have bought just about everything out of the souvenir shops. That's great. Now we'll see what the ice looks like when the players start to play. Thanks very much, Ray. Oh, what a glove he's got there. Over three minutes played in the first. Both teams are still looking for their first strike. New York's got a face-off win. Bailey's trying for the neutral ice. On to Barzell. Punched away. Turned a shot on net. The shot is off. There's not really much place to go with the shot. Oh, he's got this one, but can they catch up to him? Let's it go. He scores! And so the celebrating comes early for the first goal. better to play from in front than to chase the game. There's the game's first goal. St. Petersburg's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Petersburg goal scored by number 68. New York's along the wing at center ice. Lock back into the opposite corner. Diagonal play here. At the front of the net. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Really good cut of the pass. In all alone. He scores! Had that look of no doubt he was going to score on that breakaway. Royce is in good position, Eddie, but as you mentioned, the shot's perfect. I thought he was going to be able to stop this one. Over five minutes gone in this period. Two goals have been scored, both by one team. The Islanders got that faceoff win. Now what? Good intercept pass. St. Petersburg's forced another turnover in this very close game. Good place to shoot from. Tuck that right away. Skates it into the zone. Close in play. Oh, great save there. Not much room to work, but he got a good shot away. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. 
Let's the shot fly. Just missed the net with that one. That's a great scoring chance, but he just missed. He'll be looking to get the next one. Alone. Wonderful stop. That shot came from nowhere. Brings it in for an attack. Let's it go. He scores! Three straight goals. This snapshot surprises everybody with that quick release, and he's got himself a good goal. Grice can't make the stop on this high stick side shot. He dropped into the butterfly to cover as much of the net as he possibly could, but it wasn't enough. The Islanders control from the faceoff. Leads that charge into the zone. What a move on that one with the stick. St. Petersburg's up the wing, controlling play now. Pass attempt to Clutterbuck. Passing one off now to Lee. Shoots one. A textbook stick save. If you're driving a red truck with a custom plate ILV HKY in the new parking area... The goaltender makes a good stop here with the stick as he deflects this out of the scoring area. Just a bit under nine minutes have passed. The Bears just keep building on their lead. They're up now by three. Laid on to Everly. Slid to Tavares. Moves it to the corner. Gathered up again by Hoffman. Mishandled thanks to the roadblock. Puck loose. Pitching it to Hoffman. Directing that one to Faust. He gains the zone. Perfect wrister. May not have been intentional, but he got it anyway. Moving it to Faust. And offside is called. The Islanders have moved him all over the lineup looking for a spark from him. Nothing is going for him right now. He almost has to get himself to the front of the net and hope one bounces in off his backside. A face-off win. Let's see what develops. Trying to go to Bailey. Important interception there. In with it now. Has it picked up. To Barzell. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. That one went off his mask. They hit him right in the head. Pulled it right back. Loose puck blocked off by Bonino. And now it's directed to Davidson. Oh, an error on that pass. Good chance here. The Islanders with possession up the wing. Smart recovery by Martinez. Looks over his options from the corner. Heads on to the corner. Wheels on back of the net. Shot on goal. Got in front of another one. Driving in from no man's land. A backhand shot. Lots on that. The bogey. That went off the path. Collected by Calvin. And the play goes offside. The Bears always want to play a physical game, and their leader is right here. He always has among the highest hit totals in the league. He is a pinball on ice. A little over six minutes remaining. They've scored again, and so their lead in this contest is three goals. It's all on his shoulders. He was in on the lawn and got shut down. St. Petersburg's been stuck offensively for quite some time now. One of the reasons is he has not been able to put anything on the board. Usually when a player of his ilk hasn't scored a goal, he's been able to create something with a pass. Nothing has happened for him. He hasn't had a point in a long time. And a save. The Bears have played so well from game one of this season. Their perch at top of the league standings is no surprise. Anything you need to do against them, they'll answer the bell. Ray, thanks very much. Boy, they are the talk of the league right now. The Islanders through the neutral zone move it along. 
up that right side to Everly. Oh, how can they miss that pass? Terrific determination by John Tavares. Not a free puck now. Up the wing, moving along. Couldn't get his way through. With a shot. Sticked away. Oh, that was hard to follow. A shot. Oh, what a block. Puck controlled now by the defense. Pitching this one to Pellick. And they are in. Gives it to the point. Missed on the shot. Score! John Tavares! When you're in the low slot and a puck's on the backhand, you gotta react quickly. He looked like he was guessing a little bit there, Enzo, as he drops into the butterfly position. Not enough of the net cover. Over three minutes still showing on the clock this period. So some success here. And they've cut the lead to just one. Islanders goal. Scored by number 91, John Tavares. Fires! Marvelous save. No time on that one. That is a great display of goaltending there, Doc. And ring more bells on that one. One after another. Let's go a wrist shot. That puck was obstructed by a screen. Letty's looking to lead. Oh, broke it up. Puck loose, just a speed bump off the defense. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Nearing the final minute. Long lead pass to Letty. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Muscled long to Boycha. Looking from the corner. Gets a little drop off from the goalie here. The Bears with a neutral zone possession along the way. Don't forget that 50-50 draws coming up in the third period. Grab your tickets for a chance. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie says no chance. That's an excellent save. win that neutral zone faceoff. Let's it go. Wonderful save. Wasn't intentional. Didn't go well. Loose puck. First period has been played. An interesting start to all of this. Continuation in just a moment. And the deficit at the start of the period will be two. Don't throw any objects on or towards the playing surface at any time during the game. The throwing of any object is grounds for... New York still in this thanks to their goaltender. And saves like this one. More in a moment. One period played, a second period is about to begin. What do you think of what we've seen so far? The Islanders are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. Regathers it. Shoots. Score! And there it is, his career milestone 500th point. 500 points for his career right there, Doc. Get that puck. It's probably worth something. You want to score goals, you got to get to this area of the ice. Letty's able to clear open ice, and he lays a sweet saucer pass on the shooter's stick. He 
the Islanders with the scoring of that goal have cut the lead in half and still an entire period to play. They've won the faceoff. Good intercept by Emily. Somebody straight across. Puck has to be first. Offside. Johnny Boychuk. Time of the goal. 23 seconds. And that's a faceoff win. Carries it on in from center. Couldn't get through and retain possession. Puck is thrown to lead. That puck's loose, defended away by Suster. The Bears skated up on the side. Quick Rister! He was standing in the lane and got some up. Chip to Boycha. Looking to Everly. Propelled to Tavares. Off his pad. Able to get that one in close quarters from his goaltender. Almost taken away. Gains the blue line. Goes to the backhand. Score! Man, he played that funny. He didn't even get his stick over into position to help with the stop. He might as well not have one. The Bears have built a two-goal lead now. Perhaps on this faceoff, they can make it three before the end of the second period, at least. And they've won the neutral zone faceoff. You win that, and you don't have to chase. They chase you. Picks it up in his own end. The Islanders through the neutral zone, carrying. Biggest chance of the game. He shuts him right down. Steps across that line. New York's driving upwards. On to Barzell. Shoots. Outstanding offense met by solid goaltenders. See, Petersburg's goaltender's been the game's first star so far. He's stopped several difficult opportunities while his offense has gotten him a couple of goals. Over four minutes play. At this point, some good offense, some strong defense. Six goals, it's 4-2. Laid on to DeHaan. Strong wrister. Got his pad on that one. Can start the attack going in the zone. Didn't miss by much. That's what I would call a grade-A scoring chance, but the shot just missed the target. The Bears carrying it in their own end. Snapping a pass to Sevier. Slid to Puglia. Got it at the point. Great glove save, and he keeps it. He was really excited, guys, a few moments ago when he came past the bench after accumulating his 500th career point. Hasn't stopped smiling since. The Islanders with a clean win on the draw. New York's in possession as they travel in their own end. Has it back deep. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Outstanding save. Oh, they had a great chance. Shot. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. That great save was all positioning. Bonino's made his defensive play and play away from the puck a priority to improvement. He's really shown some as he's among the highest plus-minus leaders in the league. Chip to Clutterbuck. Moves it to the barrier at center ice. And he dumps it in. Pass attempt to Beaulieu. Propelled to Clutterbuck. That's a great save. I was watching for sticks to go up. No celebration this time. New York's got it. Fires, save. Pass comes to him from the crease. 
good rushing down the ice, and the icing gets canceled. Bumped off. Great glove save. The goalie doesn't have to do much with this, but he's able to use his stick to make this save. Solid, clean win. Passing one off now to Bailey. Play is offside, and so we get a hold. Face-off win, and now what will they do with it? Shoots one. Puck ricocheted off the screen. Gets that one on a cross. Fires a shot. And he holds on and stops playing. The Islanders with a face-off win. Solid work there by Bonino. Shoots it off. Handled with the stick. Shot. That puck hit him on the way to the net. Had it away. He covers and has defused the attack for now. Grace's team running around in their own zone needed a whistle. He was able to get one. St. Petersburg's got that face-off win. Made that stop. Didn't handle it very well. Free pop. Gathered up again by McGinn. A shot. Didn't have time, but he saved it anyway. Looked like the net was open for a second, but he shut it down. New York's prevailed on another faceoff. Pitching it to Lee. That move not too slick there. Went to the backhand. Great save. Pass up that right wing and he's got it. Cut that off between the blue lines. Directing that one to Davidson. Picks it up back there. That one fired down. The defense will win the race and icing is called. I'd like to say that the shooter was shooting for a rebound, at least I hope he was, because that shot had no chance of going in. A little under eight minutes to be played here in the second. At this point, some good offense, some strong defense. Six goals, it's 4-2. Let's it go. Save there. Puck fired down, decision made. Defenders first, icing. Maybe he's shooting to pump up his Corsi number because that has no chance of going in the net. Good job on the draw. Moving it to Sevier. Crosses that line. Takes a shot. He wore that puck on a hard shot. Trying to go to Fox. And in flight over the line. Fires. Outstanding save. What magic to even get the shot away. Great opportunity. Better stop. Man rush two on one. Wonderful save. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go.
and the goalie's seen a lot of rubber tonight. His team defensively hasn't helped him out very much, but he's turned aside almost everything, and as a result, they have the lead. Turned away with the stick. On to Bailey. Puck loose, he couldn't get by. And now it's directed to Faust. May not have intended it, but it hit him. Wonderful stop. Can he generate something? Puck free, roadblock by Suster. The Bears with control at center ice. Has that point pass as well. Got that tremendous scoring chance. Well, the goalie will take these all day. His save percentage goes up. Click, click, click with muffins like this to stop. Got a defensive zone win. Trying the probe up the wing. Let's it go. Stick to side. St. Petersburg's along the wing at center ice. Terrific determination by Clutterbuck. The stick can break up a play, and it just did. Gains that offensive line. Laid on to Mueller. Play goes offside, and we get a halt. A shooter might want to check his stick. If that's all that he's got in the arsenal, it's not going to score very often. They won that face off, try to generate something. A marvelous pad stop and a great opportunity. Onside. Right into the slot. He scores! Two straight goals. was pretty easy this low in a slot just snap it home Royce was not able to cover that low stick side beaten pretty cleanly there the Bears have built an enormous lead and some wonderful confidence here the coach probably won't have to say much at the end of this second period the Islanders control from the neutral zone got that pass in his own end Bach about to bleed down to the final minute. That's a solid save. Smart recovery by Calvert. Didn't get through. Couldn't retain possession. Pitching this one to lead. Steps in from the neutral zone. Gathered up again by John Tavares. And holds on to that puck to get the whistle. Face-off work. The puck is cleared out, and that should do it. The second period has been played, and that's the fun part. We now look forward to the third. Just a friendly reminder about tonight's silent auction. All items can be viewed and bid upon at the display near the guest services counter. Bryce hasn't had much luck in the crease today. They have beaten him all around. But they haven't completely wiped him out yet. He'll return, and so will we.
40 minutes have been played. They are getting ready for the third period here. So take us back through the game. What do you think, Eddie? The Bears are feeling confident with the score they put up on the board, but they cannot sit back because I'm expecting response from the opposition here in the third. It's dumped in. Puck loose now picked up. Good save. It's going to have to be something tougher than that to score. Pretty easy save for the goaltender as he just handles that. He handles about 100 of those in practice a day. Quick work on the faceoff. Feeds the point. Hammers one. Score! Another step in the road back. They're down by two. This is a textbook slap shot. He steps into it and launches the puck in the back of the net. The butterflies have no help to him there. Thought he had the net closed off, but he doesn't. The puck's behind him. New York's deficit is now just two. Third period, still time to go. Let's go, guys. The Islanders get it off the faceoff. New York's carrying it up the wing. Has that measured? St. Petersburg's forced another turnover in this very close game. Trying to fight his way to the front. Dogged determination there by Calvin. Oh, what a save that was. Skill play by Letty. Mishandled thanks to the roadblock. Strong defensive play. Got it all. Puck is thrown to Lee. Looking to Everly. Rubbed out along the boards. Good thing the boards are there. Steals that pass at center. That's the end. Good work by Eberle. Snapping a pass to Lee. Looks ahead to start something. Pass attempt to Hoffman. Goaltender comes out and he's got the puck on that big play. The Islanders are at the wing in neutral ice. Slid to Davidson. Oh, broke it up. Nice work by Faust. Is able to move on in. Let's a shot go. Oh, that was close. Taken over again. Great job in his own end with that interception. Fully used, tripped up. That should be a penalty. He got a piece of that one. The goalie makes himself look big. The Islanders get a two-minute penalty for tripping. This is an easy call for the official, Doc. The player made no attempt to play the puck and just tripped up the attacking player. The Bears have practiced the power play feverishly this week. Let's see if it pays off. It's a great opportunity for them on their first power play. Get the puck to the point, get it to the net, crowd the net for rebounds. A neutral zone interception. They must retreat and start back again. The Bears skated up on the side. He just flat out missed it. Chip to Sezikis. Has that one measured in his own end. And a save. And freezes play for the whistle. Over six minutes have been skated so far. Now with the scoring of the goal. Let's see if they can get this tie. Hammered. Terrific grab with the glove. Passing one off now to Beaulieu. Brings a shot. That shot came from just six inches. Now that's a solid save. Games the zone. Turn the shot on net. Score! A power play goal. No 
hesitation at all. He fired home that wrist shot. You're supposed to take advantage of your opportunities, and he did there. He didn't take much time with the puck on his stick, and it's right up in the roof. St. Petersburg's goal has built an even bigger lead. We're in the third period. For the opposition, at least that is fortunate. And they've won the faceoff. Scored on the power point by number 24. Pell DeSevier. Lightning in that bottle. Terrific. Time of the goal, 6 minutes, 40 seconds. Good clean win. Couldn't do what he wanted. That puck left the zone, and so everybody has to drop back to center. Pitching it to Pouliot. Gains the zone and looks over his options. That went right off his hand. I can't imagine goaltenders never wearing masks. Gathered up by Bailey. Quick shot. Oh, what a save. Deceivier. Save. Has it in his own end. Took that pass perfectly off the wing. Skilled play by Puglia. Nicely into the zone. Scooped up by Mueller. And the pass goes back over the blue line, so they have to recoil. Well, there's been no shortage of goals here tonight as this one winds down. We've seen some pretty terrific goals and some that haven't been so great as well. But there has been a big number on the board, it seems, almost since the early part of the first period. And a save. Laid on to Sezikis. Wonderful stop. A missed opportunity from this close in. Now we get the stoppage of play in the penalty call. Sezikis gets his name on the penalty sheet. A tripping minor. Now this is a tough call. He was trying to play the puck. But he tripped up the attacking player. Anything you do once, you can do twice. Let's see if that applies to this particular power play. Defensive zone win. So much of a power play is confidence. When you have a little success, you feel like you can do it again. That's what they should feel after they've already pocketed one power play goal. The Bears have a player who is done for the night. A game misconduct. So we're going to have four on four for a little while here. It doesn't even take much of a mistake, Doc, to get a scoring chance on a four on four. If one guy gets beat by a half a stride, it's game on. And a game misconduct. Time of the penalty. Let's it go. Good save there. Good solid defensive play with the stick. The Islanders are driving it from the wing. What a heavy hit. Better tighten up the brain bucket. Not afraid to get physical here tonight. He's in on an onside play. Shoots. Terrific save. Terrific opportunity. Not often you're all alone in front of the goaltender from this area of the ice. Great save. Loose puck knocked away by Faust. Gathered up again by Martinez. Great save. Skates it behind the net. Puck grab. They've got it ready. Pressure now. Smart recovery by Everly. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. In front. Terrific shot in close. He saved it. Strong save. St. Louis is the last team scheduled on this homestand. And then the home team switches to be the visitors. That's how it works. Over seven minutes to go in the third. With the scoring of that goal, the lead now is three. Clean win on the draw. New York's controlling the play in the neutral zone. He's through. Collected by Hoffman. 
into the end of attack. Many yards gain to Hoffman. Doesn't get the shot off. Slid to Lee. Rattled deep to Sezikis. A shot. Wonderful save. It didn't look like he had a thing to shoot at. The shooter shaking his head. Great save. Puts one on. Puck collected. Terrific determination by Hoffman. Great stick there. New York's driving from the neutral zone. Huge open ice hit. When you step up like that, that stops all momentum through the middle of the ice. Points it. A shot. Got the save there. For tonight's game, our attendance, another sold out game. I think it's time we hear from Ray Ferraro. The Bears have been up on their toes all night. They've been the more aggressive team, and as a result, they've controlled play. Well, you're right. This has been a hammering game by the team that's in the lead, Ray. The Islanders win it. Wonderful chance was set up, and the pass just goes wide. Save there. Marvelous save. No time on that one. That was a good challenge. Better stop. Back at the point now. Shot blocked. Can he clear? And the penalty killers come up big again. It's cleared. And he picks it up. Directing that one to Everly. Loose puck. The defense got in the way there. New York setting up an offense from the wing. Chipped in by Everly. Keeps it in the zone with that interception. Oh, what a chance, what a save. The Bears have gotten out of their own end. Just fired it wide. Oh, that one just missed the target. Wonderful work done near the blue line. Gets in and he'll look over his options. Blocker it away. Got to clear it here. Couldn't get it out. Swept on to Pavillier. Nicely received at the point. Let's it go. Hits the post. Try to clear the puck. And that one cleared by the penalty killers. Shoots. Oh, great save there. Not much room to work, but he got a good shot away. Now that's a timely save. A beautiful one. Pass to the slot. Pass. Terrific save there. Didn't look like he had anything to shoot at, and he made it tough. Shoots. Gloved. Play stopped. That puck is just held. You can't deliver the puck much better than that, but the goalie said no chance. That's an excellent save. Over four minutes remaining. Do you see a pattern developing here? They're up now by three. New York setting things up in their own end. Skates it into the zone. Good place to shoot from, and he does. Moving it to Sevier. He's all alone. Out in front. And he holds on, and the whistle stops playing. York's got a face-off win. Trying to go to Lee. Solid work there by Suster. Fantastic poke check. The Bears have killed off a long penalty. This ought to inspire them to go the other way. Makes that play deep. Gets in, looks over his options here. Cut that pass in his own end. Lee's turnover is one of over-effort. He wants to make something happen. He turns the puck over. Now they got to chase the puck back down. Shoots. And at an angle to Dumoulin. Wonderful stop. A heartening collision. You thought they were gone. They're not. 
you have a hit like this, there will be more to follow. And a save. St. Petersburg's in their own end and on the move. Gathered up again by Letty. So final minute. Enough is enough. Well, we are late in this contest, but when you see them, you call them. And that's what they've done here. He's got great stick positioning. Stick is on the ice, but unfortunately takes the skates out from under him. The Islanders power play gets another chance to operate. Hasn't been effective yet. Well, you're not going to get an endless supply of power plays, but they get another one here. See if they can punch through. Oh, that's a good keep. That's a great keep at the line. And that one is cleared, and so the power play guys are going to have to drop back. That's a free puck thanks to the play by Faust. Puck's loose, mishandled. Puck out of the zone, and the attackers regroup. Terrific determination by Faust. Broke that play up at center. The Islanders in their own end ready an attack. He's got it, but has to get rid of it. Couldn't make it through. Can't retain possession. Outstanding point blank save. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. He's got possession. He's got time. Can he clear it? Still held in. Cranks a shot. Oh, he had a great chance to shoot there, and he did, but it was answered by the club. Goalies have to make a half a dozen great stops in a win. This is one on a beautiful move, but there is nowhere for the puck to go. Quick shot. The game is over. The Islanders find this horn tonight, signifying a very poor game. But the ones before it had been wonderful, and that's why they had the winning streak, which is now over. Overconfidence comes to mind as a reason that this team, who has been on a really nice win streak, sees it all come crashing down. So that is it for this one. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For Eddie and Ray, Doc saying good night all.